In our previous video, we showed you how to get American Netflix on your Android and iOS devices. You're welcome, my goats. However, some of you had a hard time setting up Smart DNS Proxy on your router. Also, Smart DNS Proxy doesn't work on mobile data. It's just the way it is. Meaning, if you wanted to watch some of your favorite shows on the go, you just couldn't. You're right, Smart VPN will haymaker the problem to its pulp. Not only does a smart VPN work on mobile data, but unlike a regular VPN, which only unblocks one country at any given time, smart VPN unblocks geo restrictions on all countries, meaning you can watch BBC UK and Netflix US in the same connection. Best of both worlds, innit? Though, before we begin, do note that you'll need a smart DNS proxy paid subscription to enjoy both smart DNS proxy and smart VPN, which is just $5 a month about 16 cents a day. With that out of the way, let's see how you can get American Netflix on your Android and iOS devices with SmartVPN. Let's start with the Android device first. If I open the Netflix app and search for The Office US, you see it's not available in my country. Let's try and fix that with SmartVPN. Head over to the Android store and install it. You need to log into your VPN account. If this is your first time, most probably you'll not have a username or password. To get that, head over to SmartDNS Proxy's website and log in or create a new account. If you're creating a new account, then you get a 14 day free trial for Smart DNS Proxy. But then again, Smart VPN service is only for our paid customers. If you want to use VPN, you need to get a monthly or yearly subscription first. Once you've done that, go to your account homepage and then click on the VPN option to set a new username for your VPN login. Your VPN account password is the same as your Smart DNS Proxy password. If you don't remember that or would like to change it, then click on this link to do it. I switch back to Smart News Proxy VPN app and log in with the username and password that you just created. Once you're in the app, you can choose which country you want to masquerade into and the subsidy as well. The cool thing about Smart VPN is Smart VPN Server. We'll talk about that in a while. Now, as you can see, a secure VPN connection has been established. Now go back and open up the Netflix app. Search again for The Office US. And there you have it. Well, here's another awesome thing. With SmartVPN turned on, you can also access BBC iPlayer without having to switch to the UK server. Now let's see how you can set up Smart DNS Proxy's VPN on iOS. The steps are rather similar to an Android device, but on your iPhone or iPad, head over to the App Store and install Smart DNS Proxy VPN or Smart VPN. I'll have the link to both of them in the description of this video as well. Once you've done that, open the app and log in with the Smart DNS Proxy username and password. Again, if you don't know how to get the username and password, jump back onto the Android section of this video and find the steps. The interface is pretty much the same as an Android device. You select the country and city you want to appear in and tap turn on button. iOS might ask you to grant permission for the app. Click on allow and bip it up, boop, you've connected. Now back onto Netflix and there you have it. American Netflix right there in your face. Overall, Smart DNS Proxy and Smart VPN go hand in hand. I prefer setting up Smart DNS Proxy on my router, that way every device connected to my Wi-Fi can unlock geo restrictions. On the other hand, Smart VPN is good for on the go, that way if I'm crashing at my mate's place, I can just unlock geo restrictions with the touch of a button. No activating IP address or none of that bullcrap. As always, I'm Vamsi and subscribe if you like this video. And if you didn't, subscribe anyway, it's free.